coming to the next feature let's see what is in store for us so it is the at the red symbol so it is mandatory to escape host variables uh, in the select using the at the red so we have already discussed it so we'll not do it again and then we can concatenate using pipe operators so earlier what you used to do you used to write a statement say concatenate variable 1 variable 2 into variable 3 separated by space so that was the statement now we don't need to write those concatenate we can directly use pipe operator let's see how we can do it we will leverage the same program which we wrote a little earlier so i'll just mention the comment this is our say fifth one we'll say concatenate using pipe concatenate using pipe or you can say pipe is this guy all right so if if uh, i'll show you how we used to do earlier say we have to loop and write concurrent something so it's a loop uh, it plant into i'll use the inline declaration wa plant plant and then and loop so guys um I, i'm not doing copy paste uh, so that uh, you you all will know uh, how we can write the code and what are the errors while we guide writing because i might be doing something wrong and you can see on the screen that what is being wrong so uh, i do not believe in copy and pasting so even if the syntax is wrong is it's in front of you so that you don't do the mistake okay so it i might uh, it might take a couple of minutes more but it's always good to type and uh, learn and also teach so i did loop at this so i'll do a regular concatenate so what i'll do i'll concatenate the works and the name together separated by some variables okay so what i earlier what we used to do say we used to say concatenate um, wa plant works uh, then we'll say uh, we'll give what i give an arrow mark say and then wa plant and then description what is the description name one we'll put into concurrent this 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 into i'll put in the same plant name one okay and then we'll write it so we'll see what is written by it right wa plant and we're going to write name one so if there is no red mark it means it is syntactically correct now i'll just activate it you're done i'll just remove this debugger i don't want to debug it i removed it now i'll do f8 all right so look here so this is the output of the concatenate statement so we did concatenation of works with the uh, name one and printed it now let's see how we can do the same thing using the new feature so i'll just command this two part uh, control 7 and then i'll say so i'll i'll just write the new syntax the new syntax is say I don't need to write the concatenate so i'll just say write and then i'll give a pipe so i told you pipe, and then you need to have a space so if you want to hardcore something say you want to hardcore um, let's let's take the first same example what you want to do so we so this is a variable so we have to put in curly braces wa so i should not have told you that but that's fine works so you have a curly brace then you wanted to give an arrow mark so i have an arrow then again we want to give a um, name right you want to give name wa plant name one all right so it is still red because we did not give a full stop here now it's still showing red right w plant this okay i need to give space over here and what happened to this guy oh i gave us some error spelling mistake p l a n t are we good so you are good so now i'll activate it and then i execute it i'll do an f8 bingo we have the same exact output right so this is isn't it easier so you had to write two statements here but i wrote in one statement and i don't need to give a comma a uh, quotes over here i don't need to give uh, into variable you just have 
everything together so if if it was not a dynamic variable so if you wanted to have have a hard code that is even better so say i want to write here say write so write i'll give five so that's my indicator for concatenation i'll say i'll hard code so this is loop i want to say loop one two three four five so this is loop so this is hard coded i can say loop psi tab x and i'll give a space so does will it work i'll just activate this all right now let's run it i'll do f8 so see this see the output so this is loop this was hard coded and one came as a dynamic right because it it was from the variable so whenever there is a variable you have to put a quotes so now say you want to concatenate two different uh, variables uh, using pipe so what you can do is you can also uh, so i'll say control 7 and i'll write another step and say same thing wrt write I'll say this is loop and then I'll give a ampersand ampersand and then I'll say and then I'll say psi t a b i x so this is not needed but I'm just showing you if you ever have to concatenate to uh, different variables then you can use this and person sign see if i activate it over here so it is active see it's successfully active and now we can execute it i'll do f8 see the same thing so this was the different ways of doing concatenation so first uh, i did a variable in what is a quotes then i did hard coding this is hard coding and the beauty is i don't need to put quotes over here so in the next exercise I mean when i will show you in gui i'll show you different variety of concatenation which is more complex and you will appreciate more